what's up, what's up? It is currently 9.58 p.m. Friday, February 24th. So I thought I'd make a video because I've been being asked what kind of like, not necessarily in the comments, but like in general, people walk up to me and be like, hey, how do you like film your stuff and all that? So um, it's only been a week, so. I haven't started that much, but with the money that I raised from this, that me and Austin raised from this YouTube channel, we're gonna buy better quality items. So, uh, I, I thought I'd show you guys my vlogging setup right now, so far. So, I'm vlogging on my iPhone right now, but, but this isn't my normal vlogging camera. This is right here. Hold on. This is. And this is an iPod 5th generation. And you can't see it. But, um, yeah, it has a 5 megapixel iSight camera. And it records 1080p at 30 frames per second. And that's actually not that bad. I kind of wish it was 60 frames per second for a smoother transition. But I guess... It doesn't really matter if we're really just starting. And so, next, um, I have the tripod to phone adapter. And this one, my phone, my iPod won't fit. So I have to use an extra iPod case to put the my iPod with a case in. So I'm use, technically just using two cases. So, boom, double cased. Um, and so then I fit it in. Like this and then I either have two options after that I can use the selfie stick I have no idea I mean I know what it's for but I'm not going to use that as my purpose as what it's used for I can use the selfie stick to plug it in like this all right hold on gonna tighten wait what is this ready tidy left okay ready tidy lefty loosey I remember Alright, I'm just going to twist the phone around until it tightens up because I have no idea how to do this. Alright, so, boom. Got this set up. Now if we want to vlog ourselves like this. Hold on, I did it the wrong way. Yeah, so, if we want to vlog ourselves like this, you could just press the button if it's plugged in. I'm not going to really use it be plugged in. But if it's plugged in, boom, ready to vlog like that. And it gives you the, quite the image stabilization and all that. And it's actually really good. So, um, the selfie stick, that's a really good vlogging um, setup. Alright, so that's option one. It's not my go-to source, but this is my go -to. Oh, I need to unscrew this. Alright, yeah, because I only have one of these, and this is like the durable ones, not the ones that come on those cheap selfie sticks. This is like an actual one that's good, that doesn't really break that often. And so, the one that I use the most, the setup, is with the Gorillapod. And this is the mini Gorillapod here, but I absolutely love it. I bought it for 12 and 15 bucks, and it is at Best Buy, and it is, like, my favorite setup. If I can get this stupid thing on here. Alright, yeah, so, just hold it out like this, boom, ready to vlog. You could use it as a, you could double it up as a tripod like this, or you can use it, like, we did with the selfie stick, like, vlog like this. Hey, what's up, guys? What's up, what's up? All right, yeah, so you could do that, too. Um, so this is my go-to option. What I love about the Gorilla Pod is that you can, like, hang, like, wrap it around anything. So, like, okay, let me show you guys. So this thing, my chair right here, I don't know why I would want to do this, but, like, it has, like, these little straps. Let's say I wanted to vlog there. 
I have no idea why I would want to do that. So, well, I guess for purposes, just do it. So, I just wrap my Gorilla Pod around it because it's like bendy. Oh, shoot, wrong way. And then you just secure it up. just basically hang it there like a monkey so this is what it looks like and it's just wrapped around like that so yeah we have that so this is what I use and uh, I don't really need an LED camera for lighting because my my iPod automatically senses when I needed light need light so whenever I'm recording and I need light it just automatically turns on the uh, flash so that's cool about it but the next thing I'm saving up for is a, a microphone like one of those Rode microphones like not the really expensive ones that you put on your DSLR camera like ones that you could plug into the headphone jack so um i also love this this is a remote shutter so like you connect it to your you connect it to your device oops All right, so you connect it to your device um, through Bluetooth. So let's see if we can do this. All right, I need to type this in. Yeah, I'm changing my password. <laughs> okay, so, um, So, I don't know if it's already connected or not, but let's see. So, all you have to do is turn the actual thing on, and then just go to settings, and then go to Bluetooth, and then there's this thing called AB Shutter 3, so you, that's what the thing is called, so you click on it to connect it. Sometimes it automatically connects, sometimes it doesn't. Alright, so it's connected now. And so, now we're going to open up our camera app. We're going to take a selfie. Right. I'm going to take a photo of me. So. Alright, yeah, I better look good. So, all you do is click the top button for iOS right up here and then I'll take it so so it just took a photo of me and I really love it because you can use it for videos and everything too um I don't know where I got this I mean like it came with a selfie stick not specifically this one because this one's like the button and plug-in but it came with a different selfie stick that was Bluetooth. And it's actually really neat. So that that that's what I love about this. And so that is my vlogging setup as of February 2017. Um I from I hope that I will be able to improve this vlogging setup later on in the future like me and austin like will combine the profit and produce better quality so um that's our vlogging setup as i said 
And so that's going to be in the, the end of this video. And stay tuned for our next vlog, which might be tomorrow, Sunday, or Monday. So, um, like, subscribe, follow on Instagram at AA Batteries. See you next time.